You know, I wish there was something that made these little battery things different than he- ah! Hey guys, Tim here with a look at the RAV Power 3000 mAh battery. It's USB, charge your phone, but it's got some cool stuff in there too. So let's go ahead and pop her out real quick and take a look at what we got. There's not a whole lot in here, obviously. It's a small package, and uh, that's not what she said. We have your user manual with your warranty information. We have, woo, a USB to, mm, looks like micro, mini USB. You know, guys, why does there have to be 47 different USB standards? Can't we just have mini or micro or what the hell ever? Anyways, it's USB to USB. The thing I dropped on the floor is a nice little hook. And you say, why? Why does that come with that little hook there, Tim? Well, it's because I wouldn't just show you guys any old battery. This battery, bam, has a flashlight. It has two different settings. Oh, and strobe. Woo! You gotta like that. So it comes in four different colors. Actually, five different colors. Excuse me. It comes in black, silver, gold, pink, and light blue. So it's... Uh, I don't know if it's targeted a little bit more at the female gender, but it definitely looks nice and has little sticky stuff that won't come off ah. so it's got a little weight to it but it's not too bad you know if you have I, I don't know if I'd be comfortable carrying around in my pocket like this which is why you have the little um, belt clip so you can stick it on your belt or on your pocket uh, my personal opinion is, and I'm not, I'm really trying to, I'm not being sexist. This for any girl or lady that carries a purse or I guess guys that carry satchels. If you carry a flashlight, like my wife has a flashlight in her purse. Why wouldn't you just carry this? Because I'll be honest with you. It is an extremely bright LED, like ridiculously bright. I'm very surprised at just, I can walk around my whole basement at pitch black with just this and see just fine. I mean, it's like almost, I'm not going to say it's, you know, like my big full size, like beat somebody over the head flashlight, but it's got a great lens on it. And on high power, the thing is crazy bright. So if you're carrying something with you for a, a flashlight, this is going to be a really long lasting flashlight and it's rechargeable. So just even as a flashlight, it's actually kind of interesting. But now I can actually get one full charge for my iPhone off of this. So guys, really, I look at this like an emergency device. Put it in your car, put it in your backpack, your purse, wherever that you're going to have it when you need it. I mean, think of you put this in your car. You break down somewhere, you got a flat, you need a flashlight to be able to see outside it's right there you know if you happen to go somewhere and you know like you know say i went to the mall and you know you're going to be there a long time maybe you grab it out of your car and throw it in your pocket and then if your phone gets low you just jack it in and you know leave them both in your pocket and let it charge for a little while it's very handy like i really i really like the flashlight portion of this i know i'm rambling on a long time about a basically what is a very small battery recharger for a cell phone or a USB device. But the fact that it has the flashlight on it to me makes it interesting. I have plenty of battery packs and to be honest with you guys, I get inundated with companies that want me to, to review battery packs. But once you review a, you know, 3000, 6000, 11,000 milliamp battery packs, I don't know how they're different, right? What what makes them all different? Who cares? At, the, at some point, it's you just buy the cheapest one. 
However, when you get cool stuff like this, or like some come with NASs built in now and like other handy things, then it makes it worthwhile to me. That's you know, just my personal opinion. Um, I actually also really like, like I hate gold color things, but it's actually kind of cool. So would I recommend it? For the price, it's great. I mean, like, like I said, if you already carry a flashlight, if you already have a flashlight on you most of the time, like there's always one in my car then this really does make sense to keep around and keep charged up. The one thing I don't have for you guys right now is on a charge how long it will last. So if you if you charge it and put it in your console, how long can it sit there and not be charged and hold enough of a charge that you can use it as a flashlight? That I don't know. Um, follow me on Twitter, at TimmyTechTV, and someday you'll probably see me say, like, it lasted a month and a half and it died. I don't know, but... Stuff like that, guys. Uh, Timmy Tech TV on Twitter, Timmy Tech TV on Facebook. Uh, but Twitter is where I'm the most, I guess, proactive. If you want, you know, kind of like long term updates on things, that's usually where I put them because I, you know, I'm not going to make another video about this saying, like, hey, guys, it lasted 90 days. You're probably just going to see a picture of it and me saying, like, holy crap, it lasted this long. That said, RAV Power, always, you know, extremely good quality in my mind. It's well built. Uh, the button is a little small, but, you know, they're working with a limited amount of space back here because of all the charging ports. And other than that, this is Tim. For Timmy Tech TV. Woo -hoo. We'll see you next time.